Is there anything more frustrating than a faux leather dress, jacket or bag peeling off? What do you do with them when it happens? Hi everyone, I'm Layana, an eco-stylist, slow fashion ambassador and founder of Swap a Porté. Today I'm gonna show you an easy way you can upcycle anything made of synthetic leather. Please, hit the like button right now because I am sure this little hack will blow your mind as it did with mine. I have to be honest here, before knowing this trick I was throwing away all my damaged synthetic leather stuff since they can't be swapped or donated because they are not in good condition. And I believe most of people do the same, which is pretty sad. Every time I throw clothes away, it breaks my heart because I know deep inside that I am throwing my money away and polluting the environment with something that will take ages to decompose. When H&M and other fast fashion brands started collecting textile for recycling, I thought my problems had been solved, like this. However, when I researched more about recycling technology for textile, I realized that most of clothes cannot be recycled yet. Does it mean those brands are cheating us? They are not cheating, but they want us to believe that all the clothes we throw into their bins have been recycled, which is not true. To understand that, we need to know the definition of the word recycling. Recycling means converting a material into something of roughly the same value as it originally was. In fact, what they do with most of our clothes is downcycle. Downcycling converts the material into something of less value than it originally was. For example, they turn most of those damaged clothes into rags or insulation material. Look, I'm not saying that it's bad. In fact, it's pretty good. At least those clothes have been prevented from going to the landfill, right? However, recycling and upcycling are better solutions and we should use downcycle as the last alternative. Every time you upcycle or recycle an item, you decrease the demand for manufacturing a new one. And as a result, you save energy, precious natural resources and reduce the release of greenhouse gases and other toxic substances into the environment. That's why I decided to share with you guys this mind-blowing and easy technique of how to upcycle anything made of synthetic leather and stop chucking them into the bin. Are you ready? Let's get started! This bag was not good for wearing again since it was peeling off. What we are gonna do is to scratch the fake leather using something like scissors to remove all this plastic layer. How easy is it? You only need some patience and time. In fact, it can be a relaxing time killer. You definitely can do it while you're watching your favorite series. I learned this trick from another slow fashion ambassador. Her Instagram is on the screen now if you want to check her out. She's Brazilian, like me. <laughs> what will I do with all this leftover of plastic? I'll put them together with the clothes I cannot recycle or upcycle and take them to the nearest H&M shop. Ta-da! This is ready. That damaged bag now can be worn again and it looks totally different. It's a brand new bag. I decided to remove the buttons, which I can use for other upcycling projects. For example, I fixed this velvet jacket that was missing a button with one of them. And I transformed the bag's chain handles into versatile bracelets. If I put them together, they become a choke and a handle for the other bag. I hope you guys had enjoyed these ideas and get creative with your damaged clothes and accessories. Let's recap the main takeaways of this video. Upcycle and recycle first. If it's not possible, then you go for a downcycle. If you love sustainable fashion as I do, please join our online clothing swap community on Instagram, which is Swap a Porté. Yes, we exchange clothes on Instagram. And don't forget to subscribe to this channel if you haven't yet to receive much more content like this. See you next time!